What is up, YouTube? Spectacular Spider Grandpa coming back at you with a contest entry video. I am sitting around the house, bored as fucking hell, catching up on everyone's YouTube videos, and I stumble across a contest going on. Um, uh, JPL Flash Comics Geekdom actually made an entry uh, for this contest. It's easy. Um, big shout out to him. If I wouldn't have stumbled on his video, I went and uh, went to um, Daz the Key Chasers channel. Um, I've had I have already been subbed to him. Um, he's doing his 200 uh, subscriber contest, and he has like five questions. Uh, he asked basically film and TV related, um, so it ain't your typical show you 50 variant covers of. Uh, Spider Woman's crotch or whatever. Um, so I thought that was really cool. You know, I'm I'm big into the off the path kind of contests that you know aren't aren't really um, you know showing this cover and that cover. So shout out to Daz the Key Chaser, 200 subs, man! Congratulations. Uh, you're on your way to three and four hundred and so on. Um, you got to be 18 or over. You know the typical rules. Uh, 18 sub to him, which I already am. Um, and he, like I said, he has five questions. I'm going to get right into them real quick. Uh, first one is your favorite live action movie that uh, is comic related. So I got like three honorable mentions here. Um, first off, he wants you to show a comic for each of these as well. So first off, I'm going to go with uh, Really Love the Watchmen. So I'm going to show uh, Watchmen number one right here. Um, really love that one. Not my favorite, but shout out to that one. Um, as you guys can see, if you've been watching my channel for a while, know that where, where, where's it at? Where's it at? Uh, right here. The Crow movie poster. Love the Crow. Opening day. I saw it like twice on opening day and throughout the week every day after school i probably told this story a hundred times me and my buddy tony we'd go see it right after school again we saw it like seven or eight times um throughout the week so um with that uh here's a copy of the crow volume one pain and fear so love me some crow um but I, we just saw infinity war and that man that just blew. So, uh, with that, my favorite live action movie that's comic related has to be The Infinity War. And here is a copy of The Infinity Gauntlet number one. So, one of my favorite all time Marvel stories. Uh, next question he has is favorite live action TV series. Um, as you can probably see around the man cave here, I got various Walking Dead magazines and frames and all kinds of stuff. I got Walking Dead posters, all my box sets. So if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know I'm a big Walking Dead fan. And um, that's an ongoing series that I've loved. It kind of dropped off for me lately. But here's a copy of Walking Dead number one, signed by uh, Robert Kirkman and Rob Liefeld. Um, and here's the COA right there. So, honorable mention, Walking Dead. But my favorite, as far as the Netflix, all Marvel movies go, or Marvel TV shows go, has to be The Punisher. And here's Punisher number 28 from volume, I don't know. Uh, you know, I love my Doctor Doom covers, so I had to show this one off. This is part of Acts of Vengeance, another great, one of my favorite storylines, so. Punisher favorite live action TV series. Uh, question number three is favorite animated film that's comic related. So this is kind of a stretch. I haven't seen a lot of the newer DC animated or any of really any of the Marvel. Um, which is the last one I saw? I know Bruce Gizayas gave me a code to one of them. Thank you, Bruce. Uh, it was good. Um, but here's the thing. This movie was a toy line, then it was a comic, um, and that is uh, G.I. Joe, the movie. I absolutely love that thing, along with Transformers, the movie, but um, 
right here. G.I. Joe number one. Big part of my childhood. Love the movie. Love the cartoon show. And uh, I hope this counts. It's a, it's, it is an animated film, and here is a comic. So, uh, yeah. Um, favorite animated... Uh, favorite animated TV show. All right. What really got me into comic books was uh, Spider-Man and his amazing friends. I know there was a Spider-Man cartoon before that, but I uh, really uh, sunk into um, Firestar and, you know, his amazing friends. Hashtag meat and potatoes. Love me some Firestar. And for that, I'm going to... That really got me into, into Spider-Man. The hell was that? Anyway, um, so here's AMS 300, first appearance of Venom, and my earliest Amazing Spider-Man book, which is 89, um, appearance by Doc Ock. I love that yellow cover, so. Um, just an honorable mention, uh, animated TV. If you've been watching my channel for a while, no, I am a Masters of the Universe fan. Here's a big, thick book I paid 50 bucks for. And shout out to Dave over at Huey's Comics for a -OK this from back in the day. So, But my favorite animated, uh, Spider-Man and his amazing friends. Now, <laughs> next question is uh, the favorite or a comic book movie that you want to be made. Now, I would love, 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 love for them to start making uh, female-related uh, spider characters from the Spider-Verse books. So if, if you can make a Spider-Woman movie or a Spider-Gwen, sorry, Mylar, Glare, that'd be awesome. But one that I really want to see is freaking Lobo. Uh, done right, this could be a Deadpool killer right here. So we shall see. So Lobo. So that is it. That is the five questions. Daz the key chaser. Keep up the good work, my friend. Um, I will see you at 300 subs, and uh, y'all be kind to one another.